Hey everybody, how you doing? This is Office Upgrade Part 2. Room is all set up, painting is done, the floor is done, and we are going to set up my desk, monitor arm, get some lights on the wall, get everything set up. Join us, because we're starting right now. I'm Dean Safola, and this is the Azure Academy. If you want to master the Azure Cloud, you can start right now by clicking the subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss anything. All right, let's do a quick recap. First thing is that we had my old office. It was all cramped and didn't have a lot of room to do much. The new space is going to have the desk against the wall, eliminating the L shape, creating a lot more room to do things. And in order to do that, I wanted to start off with a new floor. So I had the same guys who did the painting come back because they also do flooring. And in about a day, they were able to get everything out and prep the room for the new stuff, which is you can see here. This is vinyl planking. And this stuff is uh, sort of like wood, kind of in look and feel, but the it is very stain resistant. Also seems to be, from what I could read in the reviews, handle things like office chairs very well. And it was real easy to, to put it in, as you can see, you just bang it in, uh, they, they interlock with all the boards. Turned out looking pretty nice, I think. Next thing after that was the monitor arm. So this is a dual monitor arm, which means two, of course. So I have the big 49 inch monitor and I'm also going to have another monitor, which is uh, the one of my old 24 inch monitors that'll go on top of that. And that's so that I can see everything that I need to and do my editing and my timeline and have a big screen to do all of that, as well as see what it's gonna look like for you as the end product. And putting these things together is pretty straightforward, but it does have a lot of parts. So probably took, I don't know, maybe 15 minutes to put it together. And then after I had it built, I did a quick test fit on a table that I had, get all the arms in place, and then mount my VESA mount for my 24 inch monitor, just to make sure that everything would fit with that and then that I could manipulate it and get all the arm positioning because the 24 inch ends up on top of the 49 inch. Speaking of which, I think I need to go build a desk. So this desk is from Uplift and you usually want some help when doing something like this. I thought I'd do some quick camera editing tricks and have two of me on the screen. So I'd be giving myself uh, advice here on how to build it, but it, it was more just so I could learn the technique of how to do cloning so that uh, I can make use of that in videos going forward. And putting this desk together probably took about an hour because I was also filming it and getting the camera positioning set up and making sure that everything was lined up just right. So that took a little bit of effort. Uh, in case you're interested in getting an uplift desk, I do think that from my little time using it that they're great, but it is quite heavy. Um, the, uh, the shipping weight of it was almost 300 pounds. And part of that, of course, is the tabletop that you get, uh, as well as the, the legs themselves. If you get two legs or three legs, then there's different weight involved in all of that, of course. And the other reason why specifically I went with Uplift is the amount of weight that they can hold. I have my monitor, which is 30 plus pounds, my smaller monitor, which is probably five or six pounds the key light airs, which are light, but they do weigh something. And then my big computer, which is actually a case with two computers in it. So that has a weight of probably 70 pounds with all the custom water cooling and all that that I've done for that case. So I needed something that could easily lift several hundred pounds and I wanted some room to grow in case I needed it for some reason. So building the desk, Again, probably took about an hour. And once you get all the stuff attached, the cable management was really, really easy because it's all underneath the desk. And then pretty soon I was ready to do a test. And there you can see it moves up really well. And uh, there we go. So how about some glamour shots? Here's the room uh, with the desk up, the desk down, and then a shot with the lighting so that you can see all of the uh, fancy lights that I have on my computer. And on the left there, that's my old computer. That's my son's now. Then we have the lights on in the basic room. Uh, this is just from a corner light that I have, which I've got to do something else because that's not enough light for the room. And then I have my Elgato key lights, which are there on the table. So let me switch those on. And they are quite bright. And uh, that's so you can see me clearly as I'm here in the frame uh, doing some stuff. 
Now I gotta figure out what to put on the walls. So I need some advice. I mean, I've got things like Thor's hammer and some cool stuff like that I can put on the walls. So give me some suggestions and comments down below. If you've enjoyed watching this video, then thanks very much for joining us. This is not my usual content, but uh, now that I've got the office mostly set up, we can get back to business as usual and start making some cool stuff for all of you. So subscribe, comment, share, like, etc and let me know what it is you're interested in so that we can make more of that going forward. Happy learning.